Peter Jan Hannes, in uh, 2013 you won a gold medal in the under 23 1500 meter at the European Championships and in cross country under 23. Today you did a season's opener in Düsseldorf in the 3000 meters. Uh, what were your expectations coming here? Uh, we know the field was going to be really tough. I got some uh, amazing good Kenyans, like basically take the best 5k runners of the past years. Um, the leads Rupp and Farah from it and all the others were here, I think. So we knew it was going to go fast. Um, and now if I would have been in a really good shape, I might have been able to follow and, and get better into the race. But now I never really got into the race and I just finished because uh, yeah, giving up is for losers. So. It's like in November you had a, a small injury in your calf. Uh, so you didn't do any cross country or other races? Nah, um, I did some road races to just get into uh, racing again. Um, and now we wanted to do some races indoors in preparation for the summer season. So with the calf injury I've not really been able to do a lot of indoor training. Actually I haven't done any, uh, one, one, um, one training that wasn't that hard. So uh, I need some specific rhythm, I don't think I have to worry about anything. It's all going well towards the summer, it's just, um, this was a really tough race to start. Um, and uh, today I've been the, the white meat of the, the Kenyans, they basically just slaughtered me. I was kind of happy they didn't lap me, because I was thinking before the race, well if I run above 8 minutes, like let's say uh, I would die and get above 8 minutes, they might lap me and that would be really embarrassing. But they didn't. Yeah, now you had all the Kenyans in front and after I think three laps already there was a gap. Yeah, uh, how was really uh, big really soon. And then they, I think the second K we all did the same pace because I wasn't really losing terrain there and the last K they accelerated again and I was so far behind that unfortunately uh, yeah. yeah. Being in the last position, um, having all those Kenyans in front and, and, and you have to do your own race, is it, is it then tough to focus or is it for you, can you easy focus? Nah, it's uh, once you're really out of the race it's hard to just keep pushing towards the time. It's nicer if you're running solo in front and you're so far behind. <laughs> What's your goal for, for 2016? I know last year you have been chasing a, 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 well, a 20 year old uh, Belgian record in the 1500 meter. What is your goal for this year? I'd love to take that Belgian record, but it's Rio year, so that's coming first, uh, obviously. But I'm going to do a lot of races, just uh, have some, some races planned all close by, I hope, because uh, I don't really like traveling too far in between races. Uh, but I'd love to do Amsterdam, the European Championships too, all just in preparation for Rio. And if Rio is good, I'm happy this year. Um, I will see.